that's what's up. We are back. scared now so as I was trying to say before Foxy decided to interrupt hey it's Justin and we are back for episode 2 uh hello hello uh see I told you your first night wouldn't be a problem you're a natural uh by now I'm sure you've noticed the older models sitting in the back room. Uh, those are from the previous location, and we just use them for parts now. The idea at first was to repair them. Uh, they even started retrofitting them with some of the newer technology. But they were just so ugly, you know? And the smell. Uh, uh, so the company decided to just go in a whole new direction and make them super kid-friendly. Uh, those older ones shouldn't be able to walk around. But if they do, the whole Freddy head trick should work on them too, so whatever. Uh, I love those old characters. Uh, did you ever see Foxy the Pirate? Oh wait, Foxy. Oh yeah, Foxy. Uh, hey listen, uh, that one was always a bit twitchy. Uh, I'm not sure if the Freddy head trick will work on Foxy. Uh, if for some reason he activates during the night, and you see him standing at the far end of the hall, uh, just flash your light at him from time to time. Those older models would always get disoriented with bright light. It would cause a system restart or something. Uh, come to think of it, you might want to try that on any room where something undesirable might be. It might hold it in place for a few seconds. Uh, that glitch might have carried over to the newer models, too. Uh, one more thing. Don't forget the music box. I'll be honest, I never liked that puppet thing. It's always thinking that it can go anywhere. Uh, I don't think the Freddy mask will fool it, so just don't forget the music box. Um, anyway, I'm sure it won't be a problem. Uh, have a good night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. get a drink of water because Foxy decided to kill me. Don't you have any respect, Foxy? God.
Bellocknex and Foxy.